Hello, this is Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger with another California report. I want to talk to you today a little bit about what we're doing here in Sacramento to live within our means. And we all know this is very important. Now, one of the most exciting developments is the new Waste Watchers hotline and website, which is helping us to root out waste, fraud, and abuse in state government. Waste Watchers allows us and allows you to hold government accountable by anonymously reporting state practices that just don't add up. We launched Waste Watchers just last month. And let me tell you something. We have been hearing from everybody, from the public and from our state employees who are on the front lines and seeing inefficiencies and abuse firsthand. We already had nearly 2,500 comments, suggestions, and complaints. We have heard amazing stories. So let me just give you some examples here. We received, for instance, a report that a brand new $111,000 medical device has been collecting dust. It has been warehoused at a state hospital because it was needed. Now imagine that. So we quickly transferred it to another hospital where it can be put to good use. Here's another Waste Watcher suggestion. He suggested that we cancel plans to hire a senior administrator for the Department of Parks. What a brilliant idea. It saved us $103,000. Now here's another one. Nearly 90 people have reported the need to get rid of some of our state vehicles that are underused or being taken home by state employees. We've already launched a comprehensive fleet reduction effort. And the projected savings for the first year alone is $24.1 million. Isn't that wonderful? And of course, not every report has a big number attached but it all adds up. For instance, we heard about a flat screen TV purchased improperly by a state employee, where that worker had reimbursed the state already the $500. But then you have to think about we have more than 200,000 state employees. I mean, that kind of watchdogging can really add up. A waste watcher's complaint also led us to find a corporate sponsor to cover the state's $6,000 cost for an annual gang and drug prevention event. You see, this is the kind of public-private partnerships that they love, and it saves the state money. And these are just a few examples of what we have been hearing. Now, I want to hear from you. I want everyone to get involved in the action. I want to hear from you, and I want you to know that I am listening. If you have any suggestions, you can submit your comments online to wastewatchers.ca.gov. Or, if you want to speak to someone directly, you can call one 877-492-2552. So I want to thank everyone who has already taken action to help, especially our state employees, because they have really stepped up to report the abuse and the waste, and they have told us how we can make things better and how we can make government run more efficiently. See, we are working together to make government run more cost-effectively because this is so important, and I am committed to accountability in, this, in the state government. I'm committed to that. I'm committed to making sure that every single tax dollar is used wisely. That's what it's all about. I promised that as governor, I will cut state spending. And let me tell you something. We've done exactly that. We've been very successful. We have cut spending to its lowest rate in recent history. But there's so much more that needs to be done. But together, we are changing the way Sacramento does business. That is the bottom line. So I want to say to all of you, thank you very much for your hard work, for reporting, for communicating with us. Thank you for listening, and thank you for watching.